Right now, education in this state is facing a dueling crisis. Teachers are already in short supply and fewer young people are entering that profession. Reporter Caleb Perna explains the impact on classrooms across the state of Tennessee. People just are not choosing education as a field. There's too many other opportunities for them. Bethany Bowman with the Professional Educators of Tennessee says there's a growing problem in Tennessee schools. Fewer people are becoming teachers. She says the stress and overwhelming work that's pushing current teachers out is also making potential teachers think twice. Unfortunately, a lot of Teachers are not are telling their children, don't become a teacher. It's not worth it. Don't do it. Bowman says regulations surrounding student teaching make it even harder. It's impossible to work and do your student teaching and even doing your student teaching. If you're one of those you know, lucky people that's parents is paying for your college, it's still many, many hoops to jump through. But in our region, ETSU's Karen Keith says she's seen a different story. As chair of the program, she says she's welcomed more students every year. She points to the way her faculty does things differently. I think our students are going out and telling other students what a great program we have, and I think that's driving our enrollment. Keith says her faculty is focused on extra support, extra tutoring for students, even helping with problems in students' personal lives that impact their education. She says schools in Nashville and Chattanooga have reached out for help, struggling to fill positions. She took a bus of students to check out the opportunities. Special education, uh, a lot of the math, science, um, those are hard, considered hard to staff. In an effort to combat teacher shortages, Tennessee has partnered with the U.S. Department of Education to establish teacher apprenticeships, those programs occurring across Tennessee. New details tonight, state leaders are extending the FAFSA deadline for students applying to the Tennessee Promise. That's a scholarship provided by the state and the Tennessee Student Assistant Award. It's due to the rising illness rate and recent weather. The Tennessee Higher Education Commission says the new deadline is now March 1st. That will apply to new and continuing students.